The author, M. Scott Peck, said, It is only because of problems that we grow mentally and spiritually. Oh, and how we hate problems. We try to avoid them, and when they come, it just ruins our week. It ruins our month. And yet, when we allow problems to take us in a journey with God, we find that we, we go over those mountains of difficulties in a grand style. In James 1, verses 2 through 4, it says, When troubles come your way, consider it an opportunity for great joy. For when your faith is tested, your endurance has a chance to grow. So let it grow. For when your endurance is fully developed, you will be perfect, complete, needing nothing. Whether you realize it or not, times of adversity can be times of intense personal and spiritual growth. Our difficult days are also days when we can learn or relearn some of life's important lessons. It is a time to go to God again, to remember again God's power and God's help that is accessible to us. The next time that you experience a difficult moment, a difficult day, or a difficult year, ask yourself this question. Where is God leading me? In times of struggle, in times of sorrow, you can take comfort in knowing that God is leading you to a place of God's choosing. Your duty is to watch, to pray, to listen, and to follow. And to know that with God, all things will come out just fine. God only brings good into our lives. When bad seems to be there, difficulties seem to be there, it's time to go to God and remember again God's help in every need.